drive. Ah, oh, missed it a little left. Rory McIlroy said, I dreamed of becoming a great golfer. I never dreamed of all this other stuff. I feel him, for sure. You always dream growing up. I mean, if you're an athlete, you want to play professional, whatever sport you play. And you don't realize as a kid, you're naive to all the things that come with that. Lawrence, with the rush coming, finds T. Higgins, touchdown. That kid cannot be 19 years old. At what moment after you left Levi Stadium did you realize your life had changed? Probably not till I got back to Clemson and tried to live my life the same way I did before I left. It was just, it's just crazy. Having to stop, pictures, do all this and that, I kind of had to change the way I went about my business for sure. So that was really the first moment I was like, dang, my life's, my life's different now that I, that I came back from that game. You hear a lot of people say, I always wanted to be rich, but I never wanted to be famous. And I think that's a good explanation of what it is. People don't really understand it because people have never been in the situation. So they, they think, hey, one more picture here, that's fine. Let me ask them for a picture. They don't see the thousand other people that have done that in the past week. And here he goes! Zion! High up on the rim! He's probably the most athletic guy I've ever seen, just like play like in college, college sports. What do you think of the attention, the level of attention he got, Trevor? It's nuts. I mean, I can't imagine. I, mean, I got a lot of attention, but compared to him, it's just, I wouldn't want to see what he has to deal with. Zion is now a pro, and the most famous college athlete in the country is Trevor Lawrence. Yeah. I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Going to school with all these people, they understand. It's not that surprising for them to see me in class or walking on campus. They're good about letting me go about my business, and they understand. Oh, let's see it. Pressure. Pressure. Oh! People got a glimpse at your competitiveness in the off season. The clip during intramural basketball that went viral. We were playing, guys been talking to really my whole team and we kind of got into it a little bit and one of my offensive linemen and he, he was kind of getting into it with him and then he came back with, at me with some other play and that's kind of where that resulted from. I didn't think it was that bad. You know, it's just basketball, like that's gonna happen. And But it was on TMZ, everything the next day, and I was like, oh shoot. This is how our world is, you know, everything's with social media and everything. How did your team do? We won the championship, so. In sports, most athletes have three loves. They love to play, they love to compete, they love to win. If you accept that, which one do you love most? I think competing, that would be that would be the main one. It's just like anything, like practice. I love to go out there and practice. That's like my favorite part. It's just competing. Why not winning? That's just a product of what you put in. You know, it's like almost you expect to win. The, the work that we put in, I think just competing, the actual doing is, is the most fun part to me. All right, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports, highlights, and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.